This is the lair of the Dragon King, and he's asleep right now. I'm his assistant, so if you want to leave a message or something, I'd be happy to tell the Dragon King when he wakes up. No? Oh, and you're not going to leave, are you? Well, while you wait, I'll tell you about the adventures of the Dragon King, written and illustrated by Julian when he was in first grade at Monarch Elementary in Simpsonville, South Carolina. <coughs> <coughs> <laughs> it's not here! Oh, <laughs> sorry! Oh, it's all right, sire. <laughs> and he's up. <laughs> Julian's story begins. The Dragon King woke in the morning. He was very angry. No kidding, I'm angry. My crown is gone. My crown! Yes, I heard that. Yes, I, I mean, I'm a Dragon King. A king without his crown. <laughs> Got subjects to meet, proclamations yes. to make. Yes. Dragon King stuff to do? I'm a busy lizard! Yes, as your assistant, I am aware of your schedule. Uh, I know, I'm, I'm, I'm a sat, sorry. Check out Julian's vivid illustration of the Dragon King. You can see how furious I am because I'm all hunched over, ready to pounce. Julian continues. While he was sleeping, two knights snuck into his lair and stole his crown. What? Oh, I thought you knew. I did not! Uh, it, it would seem, your majesty, that two knights... Um... <clears throat> Two knights uh, stole your crown. Whoa! Stole my crown! Are you sure? <laughs> yes, sire. Look here. <gasps> Julian even did an illustration of the knight sneaking into your lair while you slept. Yeah! Oh, no, they didn't! Oh, no, they did not! Yes, I have got to tell you, I am about to go off! Whoa! Oh, no. Oh, it is about to get all dragon fire up in here. Oh, oh if you see those knights. Yes. If you see those knights. Yes. If you see those knights. <laughs> ah, you tell them it is on. <laughs> on. Yes, it is on. Message received. <laughs> Thank you very much. You're welcome. Oh. Our author writes that the Dragon King went to the Knight's Castle on the side of the mountain. Oh, I am delightfully intimidating in Julian's drawing. Well done. Um, should I ring the bell or perhaps not? Oh, no need. Oh. Hey, Knight! It's me, the Dragon oh. King! <laughs> yes. If you're not sure which Dragon King, take a look inside the crown you stole. You'll see a tag that says, Property of the Dragon King! Me! Yes, I, I put it there. Ah! Hold, oh. Dragon! We will defeat oh. you! Defeat me? Wait, you stole my crown, and now you're gonna defeat me? What is it with you humans? Give me my crown back! Julian <sighs> writes that the knights fought the dragon with arrows and swords. Oh. Take that! <laughs> uh, really? uh, uh, and that! <laughs> Beast? Yes. Okay, I'm out. Beast, now you're just being rude. I am not calling you names, am I? No. No, I'm not. Thanks. You're welcome. Oh. <sighs> Julian writes this dialogue. The dragon is not hurt by my sword, said the first knight. The dragon is not hurt by my arrows, said the second knight. Ooh, run away! <laughs> we'll escape through our secret tunnel. Yes, to the secret tunnel! <laughs> <laughs> Oh. What, what did they just say? Oh, um, Julian writes it. The second knight said, we will escape through our secret tunnel. Okay, that's what I thought they said. <laughs> nice of them to tell you they have a secret tunnel, eh? <laughs> I know, right? <laughs> Not a secret tunnel anymore, is no. it? <laughs> All right, let's go catch them. <laughs> <laughs> Want a ride? Oh, if you'd be so kind. Hop on, narrator. <laughs> <laughs> Julian continues writing that the knights took the crown, a torch, extra clothes, and food for their escape. It's my turn to wear the crown. No, you wore it this morning. <laughs> for like five minutes. I know. Come on, come no, come on. no, grab it. Come on. Julian oh. continues. Ah. The Dragon King flew around the mountain, waiting for the knights to come out. <laughs> Could that be the Dragon King? Uh, maybe it's just my stomach growling. Oh, <laughs> well, lucky we brought food. I know. <laughs> Ooh, yes! Ah. Oh, <laughs> snack break! Uh -huh. <coughs> he 
Here's Julian's exciting drawing of the knights in the secret tunnel with the dragon circling the mountaintop. Oh, I'm menacing. <sighs> we escaped! We made it! <sighs> what are you two so excited about? <laughs> we stole the crown of the Dragon King! Yeah, we did! Boom! Is that right? And then he came after us, but we escaped. Because we're the bravest knights in the kingdom! Double high five! Stealing isn't brave, it's cowardly. And wrong. Yeah, but... Crown, though. Fun fact. <clears throat> when the knights came out of the tunnel, Julian writes that the Dragon King was waiting for them. Yeah! Yeah! Ah! Really? Uh, you told me about the secret tunnel. You honestly didn't see this coming. What do we do now? I don't know. Well, Julian writes that the knights said they were sorry. <laughs> Julian's yep. right. We are sorry. Yep. Very sorry. Well, that's a good start. Also, it was her idea. No, it was your idea. It was not. It was your idea. No, it was your idea. Oh, oh, Shut yeah. it down. Doesn't matter whose idea it was. You both did it, so you should both take responsibility for it. Right? Of course I'm right. I'm 300 years old. I know what I'm talking about. You're uh, right, Dragon King. I know. Good call, Dragon King. Thank you. <laughs> then Julian writes it. They gave back the crown. Go on now. There you go. Thank you. And offered food to the Dragon King. Yes, we'd like to offer you some food as an apology. Oh. It's the least we can do. Well... So the thing is, uh, could right. you maybe fly us back to the castle? That's where the food is. We already ate the food that we brought in the tunnel. We were oh. hungry. Of course you did. All right, fine. Get on my back. Oh, I caught front seat! No oh. dibs! Ah. Uh, no fighting in flight or I will turn this dragon around! Oh, okay. Really? Okay. All right, come on, narrator. Everybody ready? Okay. Ah. Here we go! <laughs> Julian illustrates the knights offering the crown and food to the dragon. What vivid color choices. Julian ends his story by writing, The Dragon King wore his crown. I love my crown. He ate his food. I love my food. The Dragon King was happy. I am. I am happy. <laughs> hey, uh, would you like some? Oh, thank you, sire. Uh, of course, friend. You know, when nobody's stealing from me, I'm actually pretty chill for a Dragon King. I know, your majesty. <laughs> mm. And here's Julian's final illustration of the Dragon King. Content with his crown and food. <laughs> oh, excuse me. <laughs> Heartburn. <laughs> Write a story about a character who is treated badly by others. Does your character stand up for himself? How does your story end? 